What's up, guys? It's me, Hi Donna. Um, just coming from work. Uh, nighttime job. I'm off my morning job for the first time in a long time on Friday. I mean, I just started my morning job, but I let me get to the point. This video will be called The Ones That's Hardest to Love or The Ones That Need the Most. Again, it will be called The Ones That's Hardest to Love or The Ones That Need the Most. Okay, there are some people out here that are obviously hard to love, hard to get along with. And I work with those people every day. I work at a fast food restaurant with um, some people who are not raised in this country that don't get the culture, don't get the um, the lingo, you know what I mean? Like, they're not really with it. They're still stuck in their old um, traditions or their old, um, let me say, um, like, language, so to speak, um, wavelength, um, uh and still they 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 um they are they are really not really up to to um to speed as far as um the american way they still um are in the the um country way and um their own country or whatever and what i have to say is um like People like that are hard to love. They, 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 I don't know, like, I guess they, um, they keep themselves well guarded, you know, and I don't blame them. Um, I don't blame them at all. And I don't blame them for not keeping the company they keep or saying the things that they say sometimes, because sometimes, you know, words, are sharp or it's hurt, man, you know? Um, but as, if you can, like, at least, you know, you know, come back with some softer words after some harsh words, then that would let the other person know that you don't really mean that. But, you know, um, you know, like a simple love, you know, back. But, you know, a lot of people are not like that. Not everybody on the same wavelength or, you know, think the same. I don't know if um, y'all could get what I'm trying to say. But, um, basically, there's some people out here that are going to show themselves hard to love. Um, like, you know, I work at a drive through I work at um, a fast food restaurant. A lot of people are afraid to show that love's loving side because they fear that they are going to get hurt. Um, and sometimes when they do, they wind up getting hurt because like somebody like me who's um, acting like I know it all, you know, will act like, you know what I'm saying, I don't hear them, you know. But it's, it's hard to put others, you know what I'm saying, interests before your own some of most of the time but that's just what's required in order to show some love out here whoa to slow down a lot okay um put on this light so i can at least see where i'm going been a while since i rode my bike through here okay there we go and um, I'm a little drunk right now, so all of it is going to come out. I know I'm just getting off work, but I was drinking while I was at work, you know. Um, you know, sometimes you got to live it up. And, you know, it's not easy, man. And it does honestly feel better when um, a person like me who is well conscious and and um this life who's very very conscious to show love even though people might not show a love back 
or I might get taken advantage of. Because at the end of the day, me blaming them for who they are or what they do, or even if they take advantage of me, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? If people take advantage of me, I'll just let them take advantage of me. Because life is too short to be to be worried about, um, you know, um, my past hurts or, you know. Give me one moment. Let me check if my tire is flat. It feels like it's flat. Um, I feel like it's getting there. I might have to get this joint t checked up tomorrow. <sighs> that's a blower. It sounds like it's getting there and that's not good. But anyway. Um, so, back to the point. It, it sure does not uh, feel good um, being hurt, you know. And, um by people who are hard to love, you know? But they are the ones who really need the most, man. Cause they probably feel like they are alone in this world. Um, everybody gotta feel lonely sometimes. I know I'm not the only one who feels this loneliness, you know? Um, even though I like being alone, but it doesn't feel good to be alone amongst people who make you feel alone, you know? Um, if you get what I'm saying, like how um, Robin um, Givens said before he passed away, he said it's um, better to be alone than to be with people that make you feel alone, you know? Um, my, my cure for that is to, you know, not even, you know, if people make you feel alone just get in the um get in the conversation get in the mix you know it's not that hard people like to hear um your word of it your your side of it you know my side i'm talking to me you know some when i'm talking to uh, y'all out there i'm also talking to me you know um, sure ain't easy but you know don't feel left out just because people are conversating without you. You know, just don't feel left out. You know, jump in, be in the midst of it, and um, join the conversation, you know, because we don't have to be alone in this world. And it might feel like they're hard to love, or show love, but they the ones who need the love most, you know? And as an intros, introverted person like me, introspective person like me, I'm not very I, outro, but when I am, um, when I am introspective, I, um, people enjoy my, um, my company, you know? Cause I bring an, another side to the table that they never even really thought of, you know? But um, I'm not gonna leave this video too long. And another thing about people who, you know, it's hard to love, man, just show them love, man. They're the ones who need the most, you know? But that's the title of the video anyway. And this is the video right here. All right, later guys. Me, Heart Donald going out, bye.